the 20th century promised that woman's time had come. Equality laws, suffrage, freedom from the home, an equal voice, job opportunities, the end of the corset. But the 21st century has offered only failure and retreat. This problem is horizontal. It's time for us to stand up for ourselves. We want a new image for our bodies. We want our images to stand tall. We want a new regime. We want a vertical regime. But we face resistance. This video didn't have to look this way. It could have been prevented. Say no to vertical videos. Vertical videos happen when you hold your camera the wrong way. Your video will end up looking like crap. <laughs> you tell us what's wrong with vertical, but we tell you what's wrong with horizontal. Going far beyond highlighting a woman's to be looked atness, cinema builds the way she is looked at into the spectacle itself. Unchallenged mainstream film coded the erotic into the language of the dominant patriarchal order. The alternative is the thrill that comes from leaving the past behind without rejecting it, uh, transcending outworn repressive forms, or, or, or daring to break with normal pleasurable expectations in order to conceive a new language of desire. Filmmakers have been slow to realize this. I mean, you have to understand that uh, the, the women is better considered in an horizontal fashion, okay? The, the breasts, the hips, the buttocks. The breasts, the hips, the buttocks. The, the women body doesn't have the vertical dimension that the male body has. The horizontal fascism continues. Vertical video syndrome is dangerous. Motion pictures have always been horizontal. Televisions are horizontal. Computer screens are horizontal but they don't have to stay horizontal. We demand the right for change. We demand the right for women to stand tall. We demand vertical. No more horizontal alignment. It's time for women to stand up for their rights. Say no to vertical videos. Say yes to vertical videos.